Welcome back to Watch Out For That Kanji with your boy Damo Tendo and today we're going to be talking about two kanji, Jin and Kyo. Let's get into it. Alright, you guys can see that these kanji are pretty similar and the only difference is that Jin has two vertical lines where Kyo doesn't. Let's dive in a little bit further though. Let's start with Kyo. It means gigantic, big, etc. And if you watch anime, this kanji may look familiar. But just smack a kill in front of a noun and it becomes giant slash huge noun. Gene, on the other hand, means retainer and subject, so you see it in public official titles all the time. Now, these kanji are also components that you can find in other kanji, such as kyo, habamu, kanezashi for kyo, and zo, pura, ran, kan, kangamiru etc for Jin. Now there aren't that many uh, kanji that have kyo as you can see there are only three but when you see a kanji containing kyo it will typically come on the right side of the kanji. Now Jin on the other hand there's a whole gang of them and when you see those they'll typically come on the left side of the kanji except for the kanji for Hime in Princess. So now you know the difference between kyo and jin, and where these components can appear in other kanji. So watch out! 